All right, let's talk wrestling, which is why I'm here. It is very, very rare. You founded this program. It's very rare that some a head coach sticks around from founding till now. In fact, you're one of the most tenured coaches in the nation at this yes. point, right? Yeah. I think what Jay up at Harvard might have a couple of years on you. Yeah. You, I mean, I don't know if John Smith had a couple of years on you. So now yeah. you're moving up the ladder. You're like yeah. top five, right? Yeah. I mean, uh, it, again, it's. I got into it when I was really young. I wrestled for a, a historic program in, in, in state at Coventry High School, and I and they won the state 17 years in a row. And Coach Smith and Coach McGarry were legendary coaches. And I I really didn't want to take over that program. I would I would I wanted my own gig, gig so that they can't say, "Oh, you were only good because of X Y Z." And all of a sudden, I, I got introduced to John Parenti, a guy for a long time, SID and athletic director, said, hey, we would love to have you come over and uh, interview for the job. I was 23, 24 years old. I didn't even know what I was doing. At the time, I was coaching football, I was coaching wrestling at the high school level. And I said, hey, let's give this thing a, a try. And then right away, I knew I had to surround myself with good people. And Coach Allen, Coach Gilbert, um, once Coach Gilbert graduated, I kept him around. He's never left. He's been a part of every program except the club team. And Coach Allen, with the exception of one or two years, he's been here the whole time. So I've been very blessed to surround myself with really strong people. And um, when you treat people well, they don't leave. And uh, and through the through the times, I mean, it, it just once you throw yourself into it, um, it's really I don't fish, I don't hunt, I coach wrestling. So, <laughs> so that's kind of where I'm at and how I got stuck here for so long.